Police and bystanders save baby trapped under car after driver hits mother and baby. A small baby has been rescued by a group of brave police officers and bystanders after it was found trapped underneath the wreckage of a car that smashed into a shop. The video of the rescue shows officers attempting to free the tot from under the vehicle before pulling him out using heavy-duty tools. A baby has been rescued from a car that crashed into a building in Yonkers, New York, after an allegedly intoxicated driver drove through it. Yonkers Police Department shared the good news on Facebook with a picture of the baby being rescued by police and bystanders. What were they thinking? No child should ever have to experience something like this. This story is amazing. Rocco Fusco the brave police officer with the Yonkers Police Department and the three bystanders were able to lift a car off of the ground with just their hands, and they saved a baby's life. The weight of the car was too much for these men, but they were still determined to help until more people showed up and helped them. You don't need special equipment or training to help someone. I heard about this story through a friend who saw the video and wanted to share her story. It's amazing what can happen when you put your mind to it and put others first. These officers did the right thing. They worked together and didn't stop until they got the job done. This is just one of many stories that are helping make the world a better place. Thank you to all of those involved in rescuing this baby. Thank for saving the life of this tiny baby. Amazing story. This is one story that is making the world a better place. Thanks to the brave people who helped. It is a good thing that you all are able to help one little baby like that. Thank you to all the people in the community who have shown their support and shown what a great community they are. You have all made this world better. You all have made the world a better place. Officer Paul Samoydny, who first spotted the infant, reached for the child and yelled, I got it. I got the baby. He then handed her to another officer because he was worried about the situation. Officer Samoydny then made sure the ambulance arrived and that they had blankets to wrap her. Surveillance video shows the woman holding her eight-month-old daughter as they were crossing the street. Suddenly, a car crashed into them, and the two ended up on the hood of the vehicle as it careened through a Dimitri barber shop. The driver was arrested on charges of driving under the influence, as well as suspicion of driving at a high speed. The incident remains under investigation by police. When police officers arrived at the scene of the incident, they identified the driver as 43-year-old David Ponkirak. They quickly arrested and charged him with vehicular assault and drunken driving. Ponkirak had no valid license, according to police. However, there appears not be any evidence proving his guilt in this case so far. According also to Metro Police Department's news release, some witnesses have reported seeing multiple vehicles involved in this crash but we will wait and see how things turn out later today before commenting further. Inmate records show Pon Kirak remains in Yonkers City Jail. His next court date is August 6. So he's got to stay put until then. We're not sure who's representing him, but we'll keep on the lookout to see if anything happens. The incident began just before 8.30 a.m. on Friday in the city just north of the Bronx. Surveillance footage shows a dark blue Elantra picked up speed as it rounded the corner at an intersection. As the car veered left, it hit the bumper of a parked white sedan, causing it to roll forward and hit another car parked in front of it. The car seemed to be in the wrong lane, but the woman didn't seem to know how or why. After a while, she noticed that the car was moving very quickly, and she knew something bad would happen. She tried her best to cross the street with her daughter when suddenly there was an accident. The sound of it all happening terrified them. She knew she had to protect her daughter, so she did everything she could to stop the car. She started running as the car sped toward her. Within one second, the car rammed her from behind, carrying her belly up on top of the car's hood as she clutched her daughter. The car then pummeled through the barbershop's glass door and windows. Officers Fusco and Samoydny heard the thunderous crash from a nearby bagel shop. They rushed to investigate what it was but had no idea of the magnitude of what they would find. Hearing the mother's screams and sobs, Samoydny quickly called for help and ran to the woman. It's okay, she said. We'll get you out of here. 
But where was the baby? The baby was not immediately fully visible. We got a baby under the vehicle. Samoydny said over his radio, according to the body camera video. The sound of the child's voice, crying for her mother, can be heard on the video. Fusco and the bystanders then lifted the car, allowing Samoydny to grab the child, whose Minnie Mouse dress was soaked in oil. The baby could be heard crying as Samoydny lifted her to safety. I think we all knew that this little girl was in a lot of danger, Fusco said. The mother and infant were taken to a trauma center, where the mother had a serious femur fracture, while the daughter had fractures on her skull and third-degree burns on her back and foot. The child also had scrapes on her hands, thighs, and chest. Thankfully, both are expected to survive. It is honestly a miracle that both of them survived, very strong mom, and an even stronger little infant, Fusco said in an interview with WABC. She was a brave little lady. I'm so thankful for that. That's what we need to remember. And I've had this happen to me before. My baby died in front of me. We had to have an ambulance because there was so much blood coming out of her nose and mouth. But she came through it. This is one of those moments that's going to be with us forever. If you ever see my daughter, you'll know that she was an angel. It's truly a blessing. I'm very grateful that we were able to save the baby, but also thankful that the other lady did save her daughter as well. So, for all of us that are still here, thank you for your prayers and thank goodness you were all able, like, a hero. For sure it is a miracle that both of them survived. It is rare for infants to survive in such extreme conditions, but this little one is even stronger than the average baby, and his mother is just as strong. Police detained Ponkurak and an unidentified woman, who was in the passenger seat during the crash. After finding alcohol in the car, investigators tested Ponkurak's blood alcohol content. He was then arrested. It is not immediately clear whether the passenger was also taken into custody. When people drink, they may not be thinking about how they act. Yonkers Police Commissioner John J. Mueller lauded officers Fusco and Samoydny for their life-saving reactions. All of the officers here are heroes, he said, but these two were a little more heroic. The actions taken are nothing short of heroic, Mueller said in a statement. The individual arrested in this incident will now have to face the consequences of his alleged behavior. The suspect faces up to 20 years in prison and a $250,000 fine for each charge.